Hi guys and welcome back to anti Matter Dimensions. So, as you can see, I can, I've it's been a few hours since last recording, and with my eternity points, I can buy this. Um, I'm not gonna get this because it's a bit expensive. I'm gonna get, um, I'm gonna actually respect because I have enough time theorems to get two of these, and I'm going to get more of those and I can also get that and once I get another time theorem I can get this and I'm not going to buy a time theorem simply because it's expensive as for time dimensions I can I'll just max all and let's see where my eternity points per minute peaks let's see um Four thousand. Um, I guess I'll set it to like two, two e three here, and then we'll be good. Um, I'm going to do a long run for time theorems. So um, so you sort of alternate doing quick runs for eternity points and long runs for time theorems. We've got a lot of eternity points and we've spent them so I'm gonna get some time theorems here. Um so I have a lot of infinity points and my replicante is pretty fast and my replicante galaxy auto buyer is on. Um so I'm almost at E seven hundred infinity points. I can get that. Um I can get that. Um, yeah, I'm getting a lot of time theorems here. Okay, it looks like I'm starting to cap out, but I'm still not at my max replicated galaxies. So I'm not worried. Um, the next one is normal dimensions and scalar multiplier based on time spent as eternity, and then replicantes give multiplier to normal dimensions equal to their amount. Okay, I think I saw that I could get this. So at E seven hundred infinity points, the replicante is pretty fast. Um, so if I can get another time theorem, then I'll be able to get this. Um, which will help a little tiny bit. It won't be anything special. I'm close to E eight hundred infinity points. Um, and I need, whoa, my replicating galaxies, like, they take two seconds now. Okay, here we go. Um, and as for my time dimensions, I have over a hundred tick speed upgrades and quadrillions of time shards. And I am almost at E180,000 antimatter which is pretty good. I'm making a lot of progression here. It's not inflation, but it's progression because we're almost actually ready to be finished with the first three-way split on the tree. I mean, it's still crunching a lot. It's not even slow yet. Um, so I'll take it one time theorem. I could respect out of this to be able to afford that. Then I can start saving up for that. Um, okay, here we go. There, oh, there we go. That's another time theorem. Now let's see if I'm actually getting my max replicated galaxies yet, or if I could still potentially get even more. And I'm close to get it being able to get 14. Let's see, let's see. And it looks like I might be starting to cap out. Yeah. But it's fine. Um I could I could keep pushing some I like really I like really like to push when I'm doing these runs to get like every last time theorem. There's not really point in doing it here, so I'm gonna respect out of this and then 
be, and then I'm now able to get all the studies in the normal dimension path of the first three-way split. So now let's see where our eternity points per minute peaks. It's probably more than 2,000 now. Um, it might take a while to do your eternities to see where it peaks, especially later on, but as you'll see, that won't be a problem much later. Okay, it's still, the eternity points per minute is still going up. Okay, I'll try like 2.6 E3. And, um, yeah, okay, um, so the next thing I'm going to get is probably that. So as I'm saving up for this, we're going to have up to 12 time theorems saved up. And so these time theorems we're saving up for the next study, I call them spare theorems. So spend the spare theorems here. But if you have more than seven spare theorems in total, including the ones invested in here, then drop out of all these, respect out of all these studies, and then switch to this middle path. And then that will give us a boost. And then once you have this middle path plus another five spare theorems, we can go back to this build and then get this study. And both of these paths are seven more expensive than this one. And then once we get to this split, um, this split is one of the... Uh, in my opinion, this sp three-way split here is the worst thing in the game. I'll explain why later. And then we get here, which is not bad. This time study makes the game a whole lot simpler. And you'll see why. Um, so, yeah. So, I don't really think that there's anything else to do. So, um, I will um, see you guys later. Bye!